Hi, this is Kevin. Uh, today we're going to troubleshoot the uh, uh, problem P02 and the E0203 um, once you have a uh, uh, continual ink system. Uh, the reason is uh, the cable is too short, so it can reach the left side of the printer uh, if you have a P02 error. Uh, let's say uh, this is a perfect printer, so I'm going to move the cable to the right, make it shorter on the left, and uh, you'll see what happens. Okay, uh, that's P02 error. And uh, I believe P03 is you can reach the right side of the, the, the printer. Um, it depends on where your ink tank is. Uh, maybe you do not have a long enough cable. In that case, uh, you, yeah, you move the tank to the front a little bit, so you give a more a more uh, more tube to work with. Uh, if a quantitative person, uh, you can take the cartridge out, and then you measure 24 centimeters from the base of this clip, and uh, then you uh, you mark it with a tape or something. So here's a 24. Then you mark it with a tape. And that marker should be about the center of the printer. Here we're a little bit short here, so we're going to move the tube to the center of the printer. So this should solve the P02, uh, P02, P03 errors. Uh, if you get the error E02 or E03, uh, that's because uh, this cable is too tight and uh, the door cannot be properly closed. And uh, if you look at the door on the left side, there's a, uh, that there's a poker. Uh, that's the door trigger. If the if that trigger cannot be fully inserted, uh, the door is not uh, the door is not properly closed. So still, you need to give a bit of long, a longer cable, and uh, so you can uh, securely close the door. I hope uh, this solves your problems. Happy pruning. So if you come here, uh, you don't have a CS, and those errors is because your car, your, your, your carriage cannot move to the particular position, and you can uh, think of what happened and then troubleshoot it.